Yeah. All right. Uh, now, Gary, please bring in Mandela. Well, this is. Do we have music to pipe Mandela in? Or? Fred, what's with you? Fred, how come every time we go hoo 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 hoo, you never play Tarzan sound effects anymore? That's a lie. Oh, didn't we want them yesterday? You wouldn't do them. And he refused. There were. He was on strike yesterday. <laughs> it was a little job action. There, there, there was a problem with the cart. Fred's been in here all morning arguing back and forth with me about Mandela, but... He's arguing with you? Hey, he's got opinions on everything all of a sudden. I try to keep them to myself. But I remember a few years ago before that uh, Jewish girlfriend of yours, your opinions were my opinions. All of a sudden he's coming in with different ones. Yeah, huh? from that Jewish girlfriend. <laughs> you yeah. better stop talking to her in the evening. <laughs> from Princess. <laughs> Princess Norris. Tell him to keep her opinions to yourself. Yeah, uh-oh, here comes Mandela. I see him out in the hall. Well, he's a very tall and imposing man. Yeah, he's six foot four, Robin. <laughs> ah, here he is. Shelly, get your hand off Mandela. What is what? this? She's servicing Mandela. <laughs> Shelly, the typist, is servicing Mandela. All right, Shelly, thank you. <laughs> Come on, Mandela, get in here. Don't drag it out. This isn't television. This is radio. He's busy doing, like, visual stuff. Yes. He's confused. He's been in prison a long time. How you doing, Mandela? How do you do? Wow. How y'all doing? <laughs> He's got a southern accent, I think. It yeah, is southern. That's how that would go. Mandela, have you been drinking? <laughs> no, I ain't been drinking. All right. I ain't been drinking. How you doing? I'm not, uh, you, you, you got a good old city here because this is the greatest place in the world. What is he saying, Howard? You have to He's saying we have a great city and uh, this is the greatest city in the world. It's the greatest I didn't tell you, Mandela, I smell wild turkey on you. I don't care what you say. I didn't know he didn't speak English. I ain't drinking no bad day. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, Mandela. Hey, I got a good joke for y'all. Smoking cool? You, ever, you got a good joke? Hey, he's been in prison, Robin. <laughs> yeah. Tell me something. What hey, is what's this mustard color handkerchief there? Uh, <laughs> that I got when I was in prison. What's this good joke you have? Oh, I got a good joke right here. Go ahead. You know what the monkey said to the hoe in the whole house? What did the mon what did Jackie you want to take this one? No, what did the monkey say to the whore in the whore house? He said, Um we be um puzzle monkey that don't want these days my bloody lot. Is that South African? Yeah, there ain't no translation for that. Oh, I see. It's one of those jokes. Black Hillis. Hey, you know, I got I got that from Blackie the joke man that I used to go see in Sun City. He used to go, Yee <laughs> now come on, man. Tell right. me, tell me what's going on. Tell me what your impressions are of the city. Uh, I appreciate you coming welcome, in. First of all, welcome, 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 Mandela. Yes. Now, Mandela, you can spend you can spend some time with us. I hope you don't have to run out to any commercial auditions today, got, do you? No, I got to do a, a <laughs> speech at a high school in Brooklyn mm -hmm. and big dinner later. <clears throat> big dinner. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, tell me. You can spend some time with us. Yeah, that's Oprah, true. You know, Oprah is just Zaza with a spear. Oprah is just J Mandela. This is all the stuff we've been thinking about. Yeah, that's right. Now they only jail thinking about Oprah and Zaza with a spear. Well, yeah, we get television in the jail, and I watch Oprah, and she just Zaza with a spear. Well, that's not nice. Now, that's that's I mean, aren't you supposed to bring people together? Yeah. Uh huh. And yes. yeah, uh huh. Well, I, that's what I'm here. To you do. know what? Jesse Jackson has a chance. You know, uh, up with dope, down with hope, or something like that. Yeah, you must have that. Yeah. I what got do you got? I got. I just, I got nothing. <laughs> I, I'm just, I, there's only one thing, you know, that Oprah bo boyfriend? Stedman. Stedman. He, he can pray for. What, what can he pray for? That's breast cancer, like Jill Island. Well, oh, what are you saying? Nice. <laughs> you know, no. That's one of those jokes I don't like. Another thing. Oh, Mandela. Yeah? No. <laughs> what is it, Mandela? You know, another thing. Mm -hmm. It's a shame. It's What's a, a, shame? a dirty shame. It's a shame you got all that cotton in your mouth. That's got to be foul. Who do you think he is? Marlon Brando? <laughs> I don't know. Now, now yeah. it's a shame that Jim Jensen died before I got over here. Oh, Jim Jensen's not dead, well, is I he? Love that He's a newscast. Puppet. Oh, the, you think yeah. the Muppet guy, Jim yeah. Henson. Ah, oh. I see. Nice. <laughs> the foul. Kermit the Frog. Kermit the... You wanted to meet Jim... Henson. I wanted to meet Jim Jensen before he died. All right. Well, you got the one. Oh, it made me sad. <laughs> <laughs> you know the African flag. Yeah. The African. Let me ask you something. If you're South Africa, right? Mm-hmm. If you took over in South Africa, you would you would get a new flag. You get a new flag and a new insignia. Mm -hmm. What would it be? It would be a big cloth with a chicken leg and a rib like cross sabers. <laughs> I see. 
You know, that's I said, appropriate. <laughs> that sounds pretty good. <laughs> yeah, no. Yeah. Not, no, that boy, that traffic is bad in the city. Yeah. Traffic is bad yeah, in the who, city. Who in the town, anyway? Who, who come to town? Just, that's all from you, Mandela. No, you just could Barry White at Sam Goody. <laughs> no, no, no. That's from Barry White being at Sam Goody. What's the matter with you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're causing mm -hmm. all these problems. Yeah, Mandela. Go to prison for 24 years. Right. I get out and Dion Wall with got blonde hair. What's yeah, wrong? What happened? what happened? Is that what you're fighting That's for? That's what I went to prison for 24 <laughs> years so for. So she could be a blonde. Yeah. And, and that my wife is still standing there waiting. She ugly. Your wife is ugly. Right. Jackie, joke man. Mm -hmm. You know what Kermit said after Jim Henson died? What did Kermit say after Jim Henson died? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Mandela, you're quite a jokester. I didn't and know this about you. all over the place. Hey, Joke Man, yeah. what's the most, what's the three most horrible words in the English language? What's the three most horrible words in the English language? I'm your new neighbor. <laughs> That's four, four words. words. Oh, man. Oh, damn. <laughs> I can't get enough of man. Have you requested any food for the state dinner? Yes, I have. And what'd you request? No, I requested this menu. Ham hot. Mm-hmm. Macaroni and cheese. <laughs> All right. Wait a minute. I'm looking at this list. It doesn't match what he's Shut up. Eating. This isn't what you're going to get. Shut up. I, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I got a knife. Now, Somebody better call Joyce Dinkins. I want some crispy fried chicken. <laughs> <laughs> what about elephant balls? Don't they eat that in South Africa? I don't see that on my menu. <laughs> what else is there? I'm going to eat some chicken feet. Chicken feet? Uh, and some okra with onions. <laughs> Some black eyed peas and barbecue poke. Oh. Don't forget that barbecue beef. <laughs> All right, okay. Listen, Mandela. Oh, you yeah, you want some barbecue? Yeah, yeah I, I want some. Bar <laughs> barbecue everything. I want some diet right cola <laughs> and and some chocolate mooch. <laughs> Chocolate mooch. Chocolate mooch. <laughs> yeah, yeah, love that chocolate mooch. <laughs> now, uh, tell, tell Robin what you told me. Mandela brought with him today some gifts. He brought uh, an elephant's trunk suitcase mm -hmm. for his neckties and shrunken heads. And uh, now, what shrunken head did you bring with you? With uh, somebody that looked like um, P.W. Bota. Oh, I see. For these a reasonable facsimile. Good for you. Well, that's the way to get freedom. Shrink all the white people's heads. They'll look like Bluto. Do you think P.W. Voter is the president of South Africa? No, I know that the SW is the club. Oh, okay. But I got this little head in my suitcase. He has a, a shrunken head that looks like uh, the other guy. Oh, okay. Right. What is it, uh, Gary? Well, this is our first good complaint call. But this, one's, <laughs> this one's particularly good because this is a woman who's never heard the show before. I see. Ah. She's the first time. And just said, who's the host? And I said, Howard Stern. She said, this is the most racist thing I've ever heard. Really? No. It's not a black woman. What, having Mandela on? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of that, Mandela? There's old saying. What does that mean? There is no translation. <laughs> All right. Hi, you're on the air. Hi, I know I'm on the air, but this kind well. of stuff went out with Amos and Andy. Oh, really? I always like that show. <laughs> Me too. Bring it back. Racist. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> Mandela, I don't think it's racist to have you on. In Loving Color has... Uh, In Loving Color. Whatever. <laughs> In Loving Color. Mm. <laughs> Mandela is really she polite. I guess she really thinks it's Mandela, so she must. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, okay, she yeah, okay. She right, yeah. what we're doing. Yeah, right. <laughs> this As most people do. But Amos and Andy was not a racist show. I don't think so. I think racists watched it and interpreted it in a racist fashion. And then they got it taken off TV, and I missed my best show. That was my a great show. show. I think the Jeffersons is more racist. That's right. Sitting around, hanging out. Mandela's here. Mm. There ain't no place I'd rather be. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah. We were just talking about how a lot of people uh, up in Harlem don't even know what you've done. I don't, mm. I don't even know what I've done. <laughs> what I've done? <laughs> what I've Seriously, done. Robin. Look, a lot of guys were up there selling T-shirts and stuff with Mandela's face on. I wonder if they even know. what he's done. If they knew him before last weekend, if they know what he's done. I think most of them know that he got out of jail and that's it. Yeah. Maybe you should send John out. Ask people if they know it. Maybe it's time to test this theory. Hey, John, hey, hey, Gary, you got that mic? Does he have a microphone out there? I don't know. Hello? Hello? 
Have you seen Scott in here stringing wire? D. Scott got lynched outside when he, uh, <laughs> when he went down there. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, man, you got... Mandela has a sense of humor. Hey, what are you up to, man? You always have to see Scott to right, go right. there's uh... Mandela started laughing at Scott's head. <laughs> Scott is ready? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, easy, Mandela. Then look at that head. <laughs> what is it? Am that a toop? <laughs> am that a divot? <laughs> what it am? Yeah, you're a nice guy. Uh, no. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Whatever it is, you need to shrink it. That's I want to. I want John to go out on the street and ask people if they know what Mandela has done. Right? What makes him a great man? What right? makes him a great man? Celebrating him with a ticker tape. All right. Anyway, so the point is that here we are having a ticker tape parade. How many people are expected? Two million. Is that true? Yeah, that's what they say. Is that, cause people, is that sort of like when we had the NBC funeral? Just a lot of people were hanging around on the street. <laughs> yeah, you don't know how many it is, but just say it's two. Yeah, they're all trapped because I know that I well, once. Maybe if you count all the people in that area, there are too many. I was once on the streets of Manhattan looking for a job, and all of a sudden Jimmy Carter rolled by, and I guess I was counted as one of the. I was just caught. I was just trying to. I was just trying to get out of the trap. Yeah, I mean, just realize that there are going to be a bunch of people stuck there because they can't move. <laughs> All right, John, you went on the street? Yeah, I'm on the street. All right, now here we're supposed to expect two million people in a ticker tape parade for Mandela. I want you to just ask people, do they know who Mandela is and what he's done? Uh, just black people or... or Anybody. Anybody. Okay. I don't think only blacks will be in right. Hi, excuse parade. me. Do you know what Nelson Mandela has done? Yes. What, what is, is that? Well, that's the first country. What does that mean? For the flight of the blacks. What does that mean? What is this? This is a radio station. It is? What radio station? The BSK, okay, Howard Stern Show. Oh, God, I don't want to be on that one. Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> There's going to be no ticker tape parade for you, Howard. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. Do you yeah. know uh, what uh, Nelson... <laughs> and you know what's funny about it? Mandela's done? Not really. I really, I really don't care. <laughs> no, uh, man's a man. Man's an honest man. <laughs> I'm, I'm John from BSK. Okay. Do you know what uh, Howard, what's Nelson... Up? No. Oh, okay. Good. You know what Nelson Mandela has done for the country? Yeah, he's brought uh, a lot of uh, hopefully peace, you know, to his country. You know, less fighting, even though he's a terrorist. This is himself. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. All right. Say, he's uh, through terror. I Peter, love if that. you're listening, you're a bum. All right. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Thank you, John. All right, man. All right. He's through terror. It's a wonderful concept. Boy, I spent all that time in hell, and nobody know what I. Nobody know. Look. Trouble, I think. Yeah, love. All right, okay. And now we're going to start the news. Don't break into song at any moment. Yeah. Now, so is there anything else you want to add here? Do you want to say anything? Because I know you can't spend the whole morning with us. Well, I know that, that I try to help black people. That's, what That's people good. I was going to say, isn't his plane going to land soon? Should he <laughs> no, his plane has landed. That's the, that's, this was top secret, this visit. That's right. I don't know what With apartheid. How do I get back apartheid? into play? I'm supposed to go to apartheid tonight. <laughs> I was invited to apartheid. Yeah, I know. You're, we're talking about apartheid, not apartheid. That's what I was invited to. <laughs> I don't care about black people. <laughs> I was invited to apartheid. <laughs> I can't take it anymore. He's wild. You know, now, you know what I say when I got out of prison? What? Where the white women at? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. Now don't call me Nelson. Why? Yeah. Call me by my nickname. What's that? Mantan Molin. <laughs> Mantan Molin. <laughs> where did you get? Where did you get from Blackie the Dope Man? <laughs> All right. Now, I have one fantasy. Mm-hmm. I have. to ask. I be slipping with a black woman. Mm -hmm. You, but you're black. Damn, this that ain't my day. <laughs> what? Next thing I know, you be telling me I got front row seat to that Joe Piscopo concert. <laughs> damn, that damn scary. I would rather do life if I had to sit in the front row of a Joe Piscopo concert. <laughs> You know, as you said, Howard, how do you th expect him to be a worldly, well-thought-out man? He's been in jail. You've been in jail? Yeah, I mean, you know, this is what you've been thinking about? I can't believe it. Thank Robin, you. what's in the news? On his demand. Now, tell Nelson us. Mandela is in the news. He is the news. Yes, mm. actually, I don't know who this man is. But <laughs> yes. Mandela's supposed to arrive. 
at 945. <laughs> yeah. He'll tie up traffic all day. <laughs> With a ticket tape parade. Oh, sing it, bitch. <laughs> Damn, I'm good. <laughs> God, no, you're good yeah, job. You're rhyming over there. Yeah. I can't even think this out. <laughs> All right, yes, go ahead. Uh, after the ticker tape parade tonight, he's supposed to uh, have a big dinner at mm. Crazy Mansion. He's uh, supposed to agree with Mr. Mandela's regular diet. Mm -hmm. Apparently... He has a preference for fruits, vegetables, lamb, chicken, and fish. And little bugs <laughs> after being in jail for so long. That's really? Right. Oh, oh, easy. Man. <laughs> oh, man. Little bugs. Now the big appetizer, one. fillet of salmon with corn and red pepper relish and rosemary and lemon sauce. Mmm. Mixed green salad. That sounds good. <laughs> the entree, roast loin of lamb with green peppercorn sauce. Mm. <laughs> Herbed wild rice, honey mm. glazed carrots, broccoli, mixed fruit tarts for dessert. No chocolate mooch. <laughs> no, no missionary elbow. <laughs> Not on the list I have. <laughs> now, not everyone is as happy as What you laughing at? So funny. <laughs> Nelson Mandela in town today. Oh, gee. He's getting sick thinking about it. 100 Jewish demonstrators paraded back and forth near Crazy Mansion last yeah. night. Black, they the South African black leader. Hmm. They criticized Mandela and the city's plans to honor him with a ticker tape parade. What was the yeah, story? Yeah, name, their name. How do you do? They named a sandwich <laughs> yeah. after me at the stage jelly. What is it? After Mandela. What's the sandwich called? The Mandela. And what's in it? <clears throat> well, it's a huge pile of barbecue pork <laughs> between two chicken breasts, hold together with a spear. <laughs> wow. Mm. This is Africa. Mm. Let's go on with it. All right. Mood. Yes, let's, let's continue. Anyway, <laughs> to open the conference, who shows up? Who? Elizabeth Taylor. Oh, Her really? She a hoe. She was <laughs> <laughs> I don't want no AIDS. From the hospital a couple of weeks ago, and uh, they don't say what she looked like, but here's what she sounded like. Don't go calling people's names, Mandela, okay? Seriously. <laughs> Seriously. You think you know better? Yeah, yeah I know better. I know she She's a hoe. Our, no, oh. I don't say that. All right? She's Liz Taylor, one of our... Treasures. Right. She's a treasure. <laughs> With she a big is. chest. A treasure chest. A treasure chest. <laughs> One day, perhaps before too long, there won't be any more international AIDS conferences. And what a glorious, joyous day that will be. God bless you. All right. Yeah, I'm good. She's singing the blues. Yeah. Well, we welcome Liz back to public life. Liz, Liz, give me the hive. Mm, she's such a cow. She fight for the homos. <laughs> she eat like a cow. All right, listen, I don't know what you're saying. Hey, that don't rhyme. And I don't like you saying the word homo. Homo. Pigs, whore, will, why just, are you calling Yeah, she's fighting for everybody, I, okay? I, I put, Please. I put cow at the end because we'll do pigs. Right. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> hey, you know, sweet but thing. Just, I imagine in Africa you got to hunt for your supper, right? No, how? You don't think so? <laughs> what do you think? Yeah. The whole thing is a jungle. I spell J. All right, we get the idea. <laughs> well, this is some newscast there. The, the, Everything amazed me in your country. Mm -hmm. There's three things that amaze me. Go ahead. Three things. Number one, the thermos. The thermos. That amazed me. Because yeah, you don't know how they keep it. How, is it, how does the thermos know to keep it hot or cold? Yeah, how right. do it know? <laughs> yeah. Number two, mm -hmm. Gary's teeth. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Damn. It, they is huge. They amaze you too? They amaze me. And number three? Did I say three? Yeah. <laughs> but I only had two. <laughs> two. <laughs> All right. Well, that's what's happening, folks. Well, anyway, listen, Mandela has got to be going. Man. <laughs> Please.